Today's Memorial Day. And it's funny, I was thinking about it yesterday. And we get people give a lot of lip service to honoring those who died for our country. I don't know. I was sitting thinking about it. I thought, you know, if I had given my life for our country, I would have missed the last 50 years. And then it became a very sobering thought. I'm not sure how to think about that. Would have I been willing to give that up for our country? Man, I don't know. So I've got to tell you, um, I have a lot of respect for the guys who laid it all on the line, who lost their lives. And even my entire family were Marines, pretty much everybody but my brother and myself. And what they were willing to risk to protect our country. So I would hope that if my number had come up, that I would have been willing to do what was necessary, that we'll never know. My lottery number in the draft was so high, I, the recruiter told me I'd go with the women and children. So let's take today, and I'm going to recommend we stop and really think about it, not just give it lip service, not just do the moment of silence, at, like the golf tournament, they're doing a moment of silence today. Not do that, but to really consider, really think about it, and say, hey, this is incredible stuff. And let's really, really honor those men and women who gave it all, seriously, gave it all, gave up the wonderful 50 years I've had for us. Talk to you tomorrow.